Hello everyone, my name is Val and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to take you on a short school tour. Welcome to my school. All right, I'm all set. We can go. Let's go. My school is not that far from the place where I live. It's a um, 10 minute drive. Of course, it depends on the traffic, but the area where I live is quite secluded. There are not too many people, not too many cars. It's very nice, it's very green. So it's a very, very pleasant drive. <laughs> Today is a beautiful day. It's not too hot and not too cold. It's a perfect temperature. I think it's around 20, 21 degrees Celsius. So I really, really enjoy this weather because in Nanjing, um, as they say, there are only two seasons, summer and winter. It's either super hot, scorching hot, because in summer it gets to like uh, 40, 45 degrees, you know, and in winter it's quite cold because Nanjing doesn't have central heating because it's a southern city. Um, it rare, like the temperature rarely drops to negative, um, I mean, three or four, but still it's pretty cold uh, without central heating, I mean. And look at that, it's cool, we're at school. All right, so I am going through the main gate. We have arrived. Here we go. Let me through. It's me. Thank you very much. And now I'm going to park my car and then I'm going to show you around. So stay tuned. Nanjing Foreign Language School was founded in 1963 as uh, one of the first six foreign language schools in China. This campus was founded in 2003 and it's a huge one. I think it would take me, I don't know, maybe one hour and a half or at least an hour to walk around it. Um, you know, for me to be able to show you everything. It's huge. Uh, on this campus, on this campus, uh, it's, uh, there are around 8,000 students and 1,000 faculty members. So you can imagine how many people we've got here. <laughs> also, it's a boarding school, which means we have dormitories for students and teachers here. Um, yeah. 
what else? What else can I tell you? Um, oh yeah. So there is a primary school here on this campus, middle school, high school, and international high school, which explains big numbers. That's why we've got like around 8,000 students here. Uh, on the right, we have a theater, and which sometimes serves as a lecture hall. Let's see if we can take a look see inside. All right, so we are inside the school theater. Uh, yes, this is what it looks like. This is what it looks like on the inside. So we have performances here, sometimes lectures. In the lobby here, uh, sometimes they have uh, student work exhibitions. You can see them right here, right now. Some of them are pretty neat. Look at that. Pretty, pretty, pretty neat. And I think here's the backstage. Oh my god. Let's go on the stage. Oh, look at that. Ta da! I'm on the stage. I am walking to the school canteen, which is right in front of me. Uh, we call it the middle school canteen. Uh, it is for middle school and high school students. We also have a canteen for primary school students, but it's in the primary school building. Most of teachers like this canteen because it's great. There are three floors. The, three, the third floor is reserved for teachers only, and the first and second floors are for everyone, pretty much. I personally prefer the second floor. The food is amazing here. I really love eating it here. It's, it's, it's just great. But I'm a big fan of Chinese food anyway. So let's get inside and grab something to eat. Well, I'm on the second floor. Let's take a look. Let's take a look-see. Now here, there are lots of vendors, as you can see here. And each sells different kinds of food. You can get pretty much everything you want here. Uh, curry, and pizza, uh, all sorts of soups, all sorts of Chinese food. It's all right there. How much does it all cost? Well, it costs nothing. At school, we use this card right there. This is a staff card, and it's our mega card. It's our super card. We use it to pay for food, to pay for coffee. We have a cafeteria here, and also we can use it to pretty much go anywhere we want. We can. We can use it to open doors, or, and also we can use it to uh, get into the elevators. Super card. Lilu Dallas Multipass. Let's grab some food. 
。哎，你好，你好。你好，要吃什么饭呢？啊、呃，我吃饭不要多，饭一点点。哦、一点点然后我吃这个，这个是什么？嗯嗯，里脊。哦，好。然后、嗯、还有还有。啊，还有一点点这个鸡肉，这个、可以，对对，然后呃，土豆丝不要翻，然后多一点这个西红柿加鸡蛋，还有白菜，对对对对，好，谢谢，对，翻不多，好，谢谢啊，谢谢啊。好，多少钱？And I'm going to use this card to pay right now. So it costs 15 yuan. And here we go. That's it. Ah, can't let, can't let me find go. Let. Okay. Here is our school cafeteria. I choose the time when it's empty. So let me let me show you around. Here we go. Also, if you want to pay for coffee or any snacks here, you can use the school staff card, the one I showed you before. Lilu Dallas Multipass. This is um, fourth floor. This is where all grade four uh, students are, and this is where I teach. Let me show you a couple of classrooms. Uh, so we have two types of classrooms, a big classroom and a small classroom. Well, um, this is a big classroom. There we go. Let's take a look. Uh, this is what it looks like. And in the big classroom, we have up to 50 kids. And here's our smart board. By the way, I just had a lesson here. <laughs> uh, the point system, the, 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 the topic, and all that. And this is a huge, huge smart board. So uh, what I usually do, I usually bring my own laptop and I use um, HDMI cable to connect my laptop to the uh, smart board. Or you can actually, you know, uh, well, use it as a smart board. Yeah, you can turn it off, you can turn it on. Well, <laughs> there are like lots of features that um, you can use them. But I am used to my laptop, so I am using it. And let me show you a small, a small classroom. This is a small classroom. This is where I'm going to have my next lesson. Uh, here we go. So uh, in the small classroom, we usually have uh, up to 24, 25 kids. I like this classroom better because it's cozier. 
you know, and um, yeah, and, and it's also very well equipped, so it has uh, also a smart board, a blackboard, um, it's got everything you need for a class. Um, let me show you what teachers have. They have a laptop here, we have an overhead projector, uh, well, everything what you need to teach a class. Yes. Well, I hope you had a good time with me on this short school tour. I hope you enjoyed this video. And honestly, I need to make a confession. I'm not very good at this type of videos. It's pretty much the first time I'm doing it. I'm not sure how it's going to turn out, but I'm experimenting. Uh, I guess your comments, your likes, your and the, 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 the number of views is going to show me if you like this type of content or not. Um, I was happy to show you my school. I was happy to walk around and um, film everything. You know, because it's again, it's all new for me. But again, I don't feel very comfortable walking and talking to the camera, you know, without a script, because I liked everything to be scripted. Then you get like a lot of information, you know, per minute. But uh, this is like freestyle, you know. <laughs> so let me know if you like this type of content. And um, I'll try to make more. It's also going to be, I guess, good practice for me as well. Thank you. Bye, everyone. <laughs>